Hey, what's going on YouTube and Facebook as well? How is everybody doing? I hope everyone is enjoying their new year so far. Uh, I know it's been a while for my YouTube followers. It's been a while since you've seen me. Uh, you guys know that my videos are quite sporadic. Uh, you know, I put them out when I want, <laughs> you know, uh, which is not that often. But yeah, I love fragrances, so I really ought to be more consistent with this. So in this new year, 2013, hopefully you'll see a lot more of me. All right, so this video is not a fragrance review, um, but instead this is a swap slash sell uh, video. So basically I have some fragrances that I'm willing to swap or sell, um, depending on what you want to do. So I'm going to go through the fragrances I have, tell you, you know, how much I have, um, show you the bottle, things like that, and um, I'm going to give you a price. All right, and... Um, so you guys can, you know, if, you, if you're interested, you know, send me a message, you know, private inbox on, uh, on YouTube or, you know, Facebook, you know, send me a message or if you know me and you have my number, you know, give me a call or whatever the case. All right. Um, and if I didn't mention it already, at the end of the video, I'm going to tell you the fragrances that I'm actually looking for. So if you have one of those fragrances and you want one of my fragrances, that's where the swap comes in. Okay. All right, so up first is, up first we have uh, Lancome's Hypnos, okay? This one, uh, I don't have a whole lot of this, so this one I'm willing to like just accept like samples or something like that. If you have a sample of a fragrance or two that I'm looking for, you know, we can do like a, a swap. I have about five to ten milliliters of this. Um, it's funny that it took me finishing almost the whole bottle for me to realize, hey, this doesn't work on my skin anymore. I'm not, you know, I don't, I don't like it uh, that much anymore. Now, let me say this. Firstly, all the fragrances that I'm selling are good fragrances. If you're in the fragrance community, you know that these are good fragrances that I have up for sale or swap. Um, but sometimes, you know, sometimes, you know, you have a fragrance and you just find that you're not, you don't reach for them that often anymore, you know, or you'll, you'll buy better fragrances and it's like, you know, it's like, you don't, you just don't wear them. So they're just sitting there collecting dust. And it's like, you know what? One man's trash is another man's treasure. So hence this threat. So anyways, Lancome's Hypnos. Um, this is, this was actually at one point my favorite fragrance. Okay. Now I've been doing this thing for years now. So I have a good nose. You can trust my nose. So trust when I, and, and look at how much I finished, you know, so I promise you this is a nice fragrance. I used to love this one in the spring and summer. Um, it's kind of spicy. Um, mm, I'm not sure what all the notes are on this one, but it's a good fragrance. So um, if you want this for ten bucks, uh, if you have some samples or whatever that we can swap, you know, uh, holla at me, okay? All right. So up next we have uh, Perry Ellis, okay? And as you can see, I've got about eighty percent um, full. And this one is nice, man. This one, from this, you're going to get some vanilla. You're going to get like a warm apple. It's a nice, kind of spicy, citrusy, oriental fragrance, okay? Um, let's see. This one, and it's inoffensive. It's inoffensive. Uh, you can wear this in the office. Nice fragrance. I'm willing to part with this one for 15 bucks, okay? 15 bucks. See? You no, know, that's reasonable, right? Okay, I'm not trying to I'm not trying to get rich off of this at all. I'm just trying to more so acquire fragrances that I actually love by giving away some fragrances that that I you know I just kind of like. Okay, so that is Perrielis's um, 2008 um, version. Okay, now up next we have Burberry Brit. Okay, now this one I have about this is a 100 milliliter um, three point for 3.3 fluid ounce bottle, but I have about 40 milliliters of this. I think you can kind of see that. You see the juice, like, yeah. I've got about 40 mils of this, okay. This was, I think, my first Burberry fragrance. Um, I used to wear this one on interviews a lot. Uh, in the fall, in the winter, I would wear this one with like dark, darker colors, you know, grays, black. So the bottle is actually quite, um, I guess, reflective of like you know the actual scent it's a nice spicy um upscale you know formal kind of uh fragrance really nice um and i i, I would normally wear this in cool weather it's a nice fragrance twenty dollars um in fact the next few fragrances 
the next few fragrances that I'm um, showcasing or presenting are twenty dollars. Okay, you guys take this off my hands. Like this is a good fragrance. I promise you. Like guys, this is a good fragrance. You will get compliments on it. Okay. Uh, so since we're in the Burberry house, let's go ahead and jump to Burberry the Beat. Okay, Burberry the Beat. All right, so as you can see, I have about 65 to 70% of this fragrance. Now, this is also a 3.3, 100 milliliter um, bottle. Okay, with this fragrance, you get citrus and pepper, basically. You get citrus and pepper. This one is good for spring and summer. Take this off my hands. It's a good fragrance. Um, yeah. Okay, uh, where are we? Okay, so now we have Yves Saint Laurent's Rive Gauche. Okay, now if you're in the fragrance community, I don't have to say a whole lot about this fragrance. This is one of the um, most mentioned in the uh, in the most compliment thread. You know, fragrances that get uh, a lot of compliments. This one is mentioned a lot in that thread on basenotes.net, and just this is notorious for being a nice barbershop, powdery. Um, gentlemanly type of scent. Okay, so this is a 4.2, uh, 125 milliliter bottle. Now it's you know it's not see through, so you you know it's hard to tell exactly how much is in this. But I should have about 75 percent uh, of this full. Okay, um, it's a nice scent. Uh, Twenty dollars. Um, it's clean. It's powdery. It's nice for you know, a gentleman, you know, if you're in your, you know, you maybe your thirties or, you know, you just, you know, you put yourself together. Well, you're a nice, sophisticated man. Okay. Take that, take that off my hands. Um, you won't regret it. Okay. So I have also, um, Carl Lagerfeld's capsule light. Okay. You can see I've got about, I don't know, 80% maybe about, 75 80% of this Lagerfeld light. This one is it's a nice, light, inoffensive, kind of spicy, citrus, aquatic scent. Um, think of like, um, like your Bulgari aquamarine, think of scents like that. Um, it's a nice fragrance, $20. Uh, take it off my hands. Okay, now this one really needs no introduction. I should just hold it up and then just move on to the next uh, fragrance. For my fragrance heads, you guys know what this is. Thierry Mugler's Angel Amen. Okay, I've got about 65% of that. You can see like, I don't know, like this is not the best camera, but you can kind of see like the water, you know, the juice kind of, you know, bubbling around there. So you see I've got about 75% of that full, about 65% of that full, sorry. I don't even need, need to go down the notes, do I? Okay, we've got chocolate, we've got caramel, we've got coffee. This is a great scent for the winter. This one lasts forever. Um, I'm I was really intrigued with this scent when I first got it, and still am. But I just don't, you know, I can only really wear it in like one season, which is like the winter, so because it's so strong. But it's a nice scent. You will, you will get compliments on this scent. I promise you, guys. Take guys, if you're looking for compliments, if you want to walk by a couple of girls and you want them to turn their heads and turn their noses, you know. And, you know, if you want compliments, that's a good fragrance to have, okay? $20. All right. So up next is the fragrance that I'm going... Oh, I... I'm sorry. I skipped. I skipped this one. This is uh, Hermes's Concentre de Orange Vert, okay? Um, really nice scent. I have, I have about 50 mils. About 50 mils, as you can see. A nice scent, man. You get grapefruit, citrus orange, that type of thing. This one's great in the spring and summer. Um, critically acclaimed on base notes and other fragrance sites. Um, and, you know, this, this is by Hermes, okay? So, you know, Hermes doesn't sell junk, okay? So, I'm actually looking for, one of the fragrances I'm looking for is a Hermes scent. It's called Pample Moose Rose. So, if someone has that, maybe we can do like a even, you know, swap or something like that. That'd be great. Okay. All right. Um, okay, so up next, we're going to... A slightly higher price range we're gonna add ten dollars so we're talking about $30 fragrance this is uh, Bogart's Arabian Nights okay um, nice scent I really like the opening in this scent it's a nice 
spicy, really fresh, aquatic kind of scents. Um, if you if you like Paco Rabanne's One Million, which interestingly enough has a similar bottle where it's you know it's all gold, so the whole bottle looks like this. Um, if you like that fragrance, then you will probably like this one. The only thing about this one is it it it, it changes, it kind of dries down, and I don't fully love the dry down, but I love how this one opens up. So this is Arabian Nights um, by Bogart. Um, you may not see this one in the U.S. Um, I had to actually get this one overseas. So you may not you may not be familiar with this, but yeah, you have thirty dollars, man. Take a chance on it. Okay, it's a good scent. All right. And the last fragrance that I have is um, by the House of Artisan, and it's called Havana Vani. Okay, Havana Vani. Now they actually changed the name of this one, and it's now called Vani Absolute. Excuse me, Vani Absolumens or Vanilla Absolumens. Okay, and this is actually the one of two fragrances that I actually saved the box for. Okay, so Havana Vani. Okay, this is the 50 milliliter bottle. Okay, um, man, when I first got this, this. This is the this is one of the first few fragrances I spent over a hundred dollars on. I don't know if I if I already said that, but um, I really like this fragrance. With this one, you get you get vanilla, you get rum, um, you get clove, dried fruits, tonka bean. It has a lot of notes in it. It's it's a unisex. So ladies, I'm telling ladies will smell awesome in this, and my brothers can pull this off too. Okay, so I've got about as you can see about eighty mils of this. I've got the box. This one I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, sell for seventy five dollars. I paid about one twenty for this. Okay, so you're getting a you're getting a deal. Seventy five dollars. All right. So real quick, I'm gonna tell you the fragrances that I'm looking for. Okay, and um, yeah. So here we go. Here we go. All right. A Zaro Pour Homme Nighttime. Okay. If you have that, we can do a swap. Um, there's Serge Lutens, five o'clock uh, gingembre. Uh, Serge Lutens, five o'clock all gingembre. Okay, I'm also looking for Cristiano Fizors Cashmere Man. All right, then there's Francis Kerjans Apom. All right, I'm also looking for Guerlain's Tonka Imperial. Now I'm looking for a sample of that, just a sample of that. So maybe we can, you know, do you know the hypnos and like. You know, like a sample of that. I'm also looking for, speaking of samples, samples of any of the By Killian fragrances. Um, or a black, I think it's Nazamato's Black Afghano. Or Amouage's Interlude Man. Okay, I'm looking for samples of those fragrances, okay? Okay, now back to fragrances I'm looking for to just totally swap. Okay, so I think I just said Apom, right? Francis Kerjan's uh, Apom. Then there's, I said, Guerlain's Tonka Imperial. Oh, that's a sample. I'm sorry. Then um, Hermes's Bel Ami. Hermes Bel Ami. Uh, if you have that and you want to swap, let's let's do it. Then there's uh, By Killian's Back to Black. By Killian's Back to Black. Hermes Pample Moves Rose. And then there's Amouage Jubilation. Okay. Now, I know some of you guys may be thinking, okay, a lot of those fragrances you named are niche fragrances. So they're considerably more pricey than the fragrances I have so you know with like this fragrance for example like we can do like an even swap tit for tat but if you have one of these fragrances like the by Killian's back to black or um, you know a palm or one of those first uh, five o'clock uh, all gingerbread if you have at least 10 milliliters of uh, the fragrance okay I will accept a decant so we can do 10 mils. If you have like a 10 milliliter, uh, you know, decant of five o'clock all gingerbre, I'll swap you one of these. Okay, one of the like one of the twenty, one of the twenty dollar fragrances. Okay, because you know it's only fair. All right. So that there is my swap sell video. If we are YouTube friends, or if you follow me on YouTube, um, you can go ahead and send me a private message and um you know we can do business if we are facebook friends go ahead and uh, inbox me 
and um, you know if you, if you have my number or you know if you want to text me or whatever you can do that as well okay thank you guys so much for watching I'm trying to help you guys smell great okay so take one of these off my hands all right thank you so much bye